Hi, I'm Chili Bin, and this is Raiden. We met on day two of our Appalachian Trail through hike and ended up hiking the whole thing together. Now we're in New Zealand, we live in Nelson, and explore the country every opportunity we get. Subscribe to come along with us as we explore the great outdoors. Hi guys, Chili Bin here. It's the day before New Year's Eve and Red and I have just driven into the Cobb Valley with a lot of traffic because of a music festival and we're starting a four day circuit that'll take us around the reservoir to Lake Sylvester, uh, probably the Lake Peel, doing some off track ridge walking Lots of good stuff, really looking forward to it. Uh, but unfortunately we have to start off with a four kilometre road walk. So here we are just walking down the gravel road. Sylvester Hut off in the distance. So we had a little bit of a change of plan. Um, originally we wanted to go up to Lake Sylvester or maybe one of the other lakes and camp for the night. But as we got up here, it was super windy and it's kind of starting to rain. So we got to Sylvester Hut and it turns out it's not a bookable hut, which I don't know why I thought it was. So we're able to stay here with our annual hut passes. So we've done that. There's a family of four here as well uh, and a couple that have just arrived after us. Kind of sad that we're not camping up at the lakes tonight. Uh, we have a brand new tent, so I was really excited about trying that out. But with the amount of wind and it probably raining, uh, it seemed much more sensible to just stay at the hut. And actually as I sit here I'm starting to get raindrops on me so that seems like a pretty good time to go inside and chill out for the rest of the evening. Good morning! We're just setting off for the day, it's about 20 past 7 and we're leaving Sylvester Hut and heading up towards Sylvester Lake and Little Sylvester Lake and then Iron Lake beyond that and then uh, up onto Iron Hill and along Lockett Range There's uh, no official trail along here but I gather that quite a lot of people have walked it so there's a pretty well-worn footpath up along the ranges today and then just depending on how we go we'll find a spot to camp with some water somewhere along there I'm pretty glad we didn't try and camp at the lakes last night uh, it got really windy for a little while in the middle of the night so it probably wouldn't have been a very nice night in the tent <laughs> We've pretty much reached the summit of Iron Hill. You can see Lake Sylvester, Little Sylvester and Iron Lake down behind us. And the hut was a little bit off in the distance.
We've just come out of the bush just there. And now we're in the Cobb Valley, which is absolutely beautiful. And down here there's a gentle breeze and the warm sun. So we're heading this way, we've crossed the river, and then we'll join up with the track on the other side of the river. Quick download on what happened today. I didn't get that much video footage. Uh, after leaving Sylvester Hut, we went up Iron Hill and then After leaving Sylvester Hut, we went up Iron Hill and then followed the ridge line all the way along to Mount Benson. From Benson, well, even before Benson, the trail was pretty dodgy. And then after Benson, it got quite dodgy and we uh, opted to come down into the valley from there. So we did a bit of bush bashing down a stream valley um, until we got back into the bottom of the Cobb Valley. Once we hit the Cobb Valley, we uh, were going to hit the track, but the track wasn't along the river at that point in time. And so we followed the river for a bit until we hit a couple of waterfalls. So we did a bit of bush bashing from there and uh, eventually rejoined the track. And now we're at Chaffee's Hut, I think. I'm not sure, I'll look it up. It's only a little four bunk hut and it's full. So we've got the tent set up down here in the bush um, and uh, ready to settle down for the night already. It's New Year's Eve, but we won't be staying up at all. Uh, we did about a 10 and a half hour day today, which is a pretty long day for us recently anyway. Uh, and those were hard 10 and a half hours. So uh, really ready to settle down and relax for the evening. Here's our little campsite for the night. We've got a brand new tent, first night out. Good morning. It's about 10.15 and we're just leaving Chaffee Hut where we camped last night. Uh, we're walking on a nice and easy trail out the Cobb Valley down to Trilobite Hut. And then, we're not sure we might stay there tonight. It's only about five or six k's walk from here. Or uh, if it's busy, we might keep going a little further to Mitten's Hut. I will just see what happens. Either way, it's gonna be a nice, short, easy day for us today. Both of us are feeling it a little bit after our long day yesterday, so it's good to have a nice short one today. got to Trilobite Hut, which is just over there, and we stopped there for a little bit and had some food, um, and then a bunch of other people came and they started up a barbecue and stuff. So we've moved on now, we're going to walk 20 minutes up this hill to Mitten's Hut, and I think that'll be our stopping point for today. So tomorrow we go up Lake Peel track and for now we go this way to that hut. Good 
morning. We're just getting started leaving Mitten's hut, heading up the Lake Peel track to the ridge. That's about half past seven. And the dock signs say five to six hours back to where the car is. Uh, lots of climbing today. We're starting off with a 500 meter climb, uh, followed by a 400 meter descent, and then another 400 meter climb. <laughs> So lots of up and down. We've come across several trees with like a mesh cage around them and this plant with red flowers. Not sure what it is. A quick look back behind us. This is our current climb. It's really hot. 